My grandma and me, we keep each other company. What's going on, YouTube? Hey! Man is here. Whoa! This video is dedicated to Lupe, Lupe. from. The Lupe Experience. What's going on, brother? That's right. Amanda's gonna let you. Lupe, Lupe speaks very Hi, highly like of oh, you. Yeah, he does. Oh, nice. I know he's a wonderful, man. Yes, he is. <laughs> but he speaks very highly of Reflection Man. Says ladies just love it. It's it's like one of the ultimate panty droppers. Let's get into what I think of it, and let's find out what you think of it. Okay. <laughs> Let's do that. First off, okay. got to describe the scent just a, a little bit. Uh, Reflection Man introduced in 2007 and basically what you get is um, a jasmine and sandalwood fragrance with vanilla, with a vanilla tone to it. Uh, a little bit, just a whisper of spice flowing through there and as this fragrance uh, dries down, a little bit of woods come into play to help it out a little bit for me cedar and vetiver come out show its face a little bit but it still keeps that creamy powdery floral kind of tone throughout its whole life which um, longevity is excellent 10 plus hours projection is great it does its job it's not a beast it's moderate so it's okay uh, so it doesn't fail in, in those areas oh, that's good. Uh, <laughs> but as far as my personal thoughts here we go. <laughs> My personal thoughts from the first time that I ever smelt this, I was like, this stuff is feminine. Mm -hmm. I mean, even but too feminine for feminine. <laughs> and I know that there's a lot of love for this fragrance out there. I mean, there's a lot of men out there that love this stuff. Yeah, there you go. And all this time seeing posts about it out there, I'm just like, what are these? Who are these men? What are they smelling? It's freaking jasmine. It's powdery. It's floral. And I remember the first time I had Amanda smell this. I did a split of this fragrance, and uh, it was hell for me. Complete hell. Uh, not a fan of jasmine and this fragrance. I don't know. It's like, oh, God. It's not like it. So I had to have Amanda smell it, and she took a whiff, and immediately I thought it was funny because she was like, that's for a man? She's like, that would be something that I would love on me. But we're going to see what she thinks about it today. I've got the dry down on this arm, and I'm going to spritz a fresh blast on the other arm and see what she thinks about it today. Because actually, I've worn it a few times this week, and it hasn't really nauseated me as much as it used to. Mm -hmm. I can kind of tolerate it, I guess. <laughs> like, I guess. I guess. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> let's see, what you, let's see okay. what you think about it. Okay. Here, let, let's do let's the do top first. Time. I have to get rid of this dog, but he is somehow <laughs> dug his claws into my arm. See? Like, I, like, I can't, I can't. He missed you. <laughs> I think so. You've been gone all day. I know. Okay, so, here we go. All right, here, here we go. Here's the initial smell. Tell Lupe what you think. Be honest. All right. Lupe, it smells very citrusy and very clean, but it also smells really... Very floral, but it smells like a girl. It smells like a girl? It does. Yeah, it does smell like a girl. Like, it smells like the top notes for, like, a woman's fragrance. And let me smell it again. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of um, a couple of the women fragrances I've smelled at work a few times. Yeah. Here's the dry down. That's kind of weird, right? Like right here? I don't know. It's somewhere on there. Okay. <laughs> dig all over. It, well, the dry down's not that... It's, it's a little more woody. Yeah, the dry down's not that bad. A little more cedar comes out. It gets be oh, a little bit better, for me anyway. But it seems so close to the skin. Well, that's because you just took a big whiff of the first blast, which is going to be... I should have let you smell the dry down first, so I kind of screwed that up. Shame Lessons on you. Lessons learned. Shame. Because <laughs> learn. right. you got a big nose full of that initial blast, which is going to kind of well, ruin the dry down for you. But the dry down's okay. Right, I smell puppy hair, so okay, let's do this again. Nah, it still smells like it's close to the skin. Yeah? Yeah. Like, even when you with the projection and stuff, I didn't really 
tell that you had it on yeah. until you told me. So oh, it's, yeah. so it stays, I mean, like close to the skin for you. Could be on somebody else. You could smell it like across the hall. <laughs> now, let's get to the feedback. Okay. What did the women at work say about this? Now, I'm going to be honest. It was about half and half, actually, and I was kind of shocked because uh, some of the women said that they could see it on a man. And I was kind of shocked. I'm looking at him. I'm like, are you nuts? Are you smelling the same thing? It's freaking floral. It's powdery. It smells like a chick fragrance. But they were like, but of course they were a few hours into the dry down by the time the ladies at work smelled it. Mm -hmm. So they didn't, get, they didn't get a whiff of the top. But then the other half of them said powdery, floral, no way, not for a man. Right. So, you know, all up to taste, you know, basically that's what it is. This is my experience. I find it to be way too feminine. And so do you. Yeah, I do. Like, I, I don't think I could see you wearing it. <laughs> okay. Just what about Sundays after church when I cross-dress? <laughs> That's true. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that may be. I could see that. That's a good time. You should come up. We should film that. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, it'd be like Rocky Horror. All over. <clears throat> no, I mean, I don't, like, if... Like, I don't know you the way I know you now. Yeah. Like, I probably could not see you wear this. Right? Yeah. yeah. And, um, yeah, there's some people, like, I know one person that could wear it at my job. I could see that. But then... A man? Yeah. Why? Is he kind of... Yeah. Is he... Yeah. Oh, yeah, he's yeah. kind of... Yeah. He's kind of... Feminine. But I, I love him to pieces, though. <laughs> yeah. So, um, but... Because he wears Angel. Oh, yeah? So, and that's Angel for women. Or what? no, yeah. Oh, no, Alien. I'm sorry. Alien? Alien. So, mm, I can see that. Yeah. <laughs> so. But, but I'm not what? saying that it's all for gender, like, you <laughs> know. know. But, I mean, it smells more like a feminine female fragrance. Yeah. So, what do you think I would rate this fragrance? Remember? Top shelf, bottom shelf, junk drawer. Where um, is this going? For me. Probably the bottom. What what bottom? The very bottom, the junk drawer. The junk drawer! You, lady, are two for two. <laughs> Absolutely correct. This is going in my junk drawer. This is something that I'm probably never gonna wear again. Uh I and and as far as quality goes. I mean for yeah. Cause okay. cause that's for my taste. As far as quality goes, I don't even really find it to be that astounding. For quality, I find it to be just kind of mediocre, just kind of average. Nothing that really I smell and blows me away. If I'm going for something creamy and powdery with a feel like that, I'm definitely going for Dior Homme Intense all day long or Shalimar. This stuff, I don't know, there's just no depth. It's just kind of, hey, yeah, here I am. I smell like a woman. Hear me roar. <laughs> just kidding. Well, <laughs> I'm just worry, kidding. I'll, I'll talk to him later. <laughs> let's get, let's see. What, Luke. what Luca Turin? What do you think Luca Turin rates this fragrance? Oh, probably a five. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. <laughs> I went down and I was thinking, you know. That's what I was thinking. One. This is going to be a five star all the way. But what he gave Reflection Man. <laughs> I'm just loving this. For once, me and this man are kind of on the same page. He gave Reflection Man. A one star! Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah, and this is what he says. Having met the female of the species, I was dreading this one. It turns out to be a sedated habanita, haban, habanita, I don't know what that is. A milky, vanillic, oriental, like a giant marshmallow with a cedar vetiver dry down that struggles unsuccessfully to put some spine into it. Definitely not a good masculine, <laughs> but could be fun. On a woman, if she likes trashy ambers. <laughs> well. I freaking love that. <laughs> oh my gosh. Lupe, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, not really. Shut <laughs> up, you're so insensitive. That's probably why you couldn't wear that. What do you mean? I'm kind of like a trashy woman sometimes. Yeah, you're a trashy amber. Yeah, that's right. So... What's funny is, when I picture, my mental picture for Amouage Reflection Man, 
Are you ready for this? Oh, yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> oh, my <laughs> There's God. a grandma that's all horned up. She's got to go to town. She's got to get some action. So she sprinkles on herself some reflection man because she's got to get herself a man. She's heading down to bingo night, and she's going to drop some grandpa boxers. Oh, my God. <laughs> that uh, is reflection, casino, right? reflection man in a bottle. Pure grandpa boxer dropper juice. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> oh, oh That's yeah. right. Oh, yeah. oh, I don't know about you. But it's true, I could probably see that then. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah? I could see then the old man be like, what do you, what do you, what do you smell so fancy? You smell so fancy, Grandma. I'd be like, well, son, I'm wearing a reflection man. <laughs> She'd be like, say what? <laughs> Oh, Dan. All right, so that's it. That's it. That's Reflection Man. I hope you enjoyed, Lupe. I hope I've uh, given you some good laughs, good smile. Cannot wait to see your response, brother. That's right. So, that's it. Should Let it say? be all on him, not on me. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to say. <laughs> oh, okay. That's it. That's it. You guys, take care. And we will see you later. Bye. Uh. Like, you're like... And Miss Mary, Mac, 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 I'll just sit like it. <laughs> Damn, just, kids. That just makes me want to slap your ass. Oh, I saw a really cool picture that had that. I have to show you that later. What? Basically, he's grabbing her hair like so, and then yeah. he had a finger right up there. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a good picture. Mm -hmm. Well, you know, Pinterest, they get all kinds of stuff. All right, ready? All right. Here we go. go. Okay, let's dance it. Let's go. <laughs> oh!